Hi guys, my name is Michelle and I create hair, makeup and lifestyle content here on YouTube. Today I'm talking about what I bought for my birthday. So it's like a what I got and what I bought video. So if that sounds like something that interests you, then keep watching. Okay, so firstly, uh, I have to say that I'm very, very aware that there's a global pandemic going on. In no way am I saying that, hey, look, look, this is what I bought. You should buy it too. That's not what I'm doing. I'm just showing you all of the things that I bought on the 30th of December. It was my birthday. And as always on my birthday, uh, people give me money. And especially now that I've started YouTube and uh, YouTube is very, very expensive. I have to keep buying inventory. The number of times that people will message me saying that, hey, have you tried XYZ shampoo from this brand? It's crazy. Uh, what I realize is that I'll have to try so many products because if I'm suggesting something to you guys, it's very important that I try the product. I agree with what I'm suggesting. I'm not just randomly saying that, hey, this is CG approved, you can use this. I realize that I have a lot of students watching me and I realize that some people get 3000 rupees to manage the entire month. And so even if I'm recommending something that is 300 rupees, I take my recommendations very, very seriously. Even if you guys spend 100 rupees, right, on my recommendation, I take that responsibility very, very seriously. So yeah, I'm not pushing anything on you. I'm just sharing my haul. I'm really happy. Sometimes brands send me products and it's really cool because that way, look, no matter what happens, I'll spend a lifetime, but I still won't be able to buy all of the products out there. So yeah, um, I have a brand that has sent me something that is also gonna be part of this haul. But yeah, I'm super grateful to brands when they send me stuff. Apart from the one thing that I'm showing you in this haul, the rest of it I bought with my own money or rather money that was gifted to me by my parents and friends and family and stuff. And also money that I'd sort of saved up that I wanted to spend to buy inventory for YouTube. Yeah, you can call it that. So yeah, long disclaimer, but it is important that I give you guys one. Let's get into the haul. All right, so the very first thing that I bought was a set of bathrobes. I'm gonna put up the Amazon little thing here. So these are just two pink bathrobes. They come in a set. One has sleeves that are three quarter. Guys, something about the color pink. A few years ago, I was obsessed with turquoise and now my favorite color is like pink. Not to wear so much, but like in my accessories, I really like the color pink. So yeah, this is the second bathrobe and this has like a short sleeve. They come in pairs and I thought this was really cute and quite inexpensive compared to the other bathrobes that I saw on Amazon. I also bought a set extra, so two extra. That I'm going to be putting into a giveaway coming really soon. Prices for all of the items will be on the screen somewhere here. Here, let's get to the next item. Okay, I'm sure you guys know that I absolutely love my shampoo brush. And I think I picked this up from Miniso, but it's getting really dirty inside. I'm not being able to clean inside. And just thinking about all of the bacteria that is accumulating in this was enough to send me spiraling. And this one, I've been eyeing this for a while now. I had put the link to this in my description in my very first curly wavy hair routine. Some of you bought it, you got back to me and told me that you love it. You found the quality to be excellent and so I was like, yeah, I'm getting this. Hello, it's pink. So this is from the company called Ross. These are silicone. I'm not going to have any trouble cleaning this. It feels, I mean, I still, I haven't used it yet. But oh my goodness, this seems like a brush that I'm really going to enjoy. I'm really excited for this. Since we're talking about the color pink and my current obsession with it, I have to show you these slippers that I got. What I really like about the slippers are that it has these shock absorbing grippy things so that I won't slip. Guys, one hour before my birthday, my doggy had spilled some water on the floor 
and I was wearing hotel chappals, those hotel slip-on slippers. They don't have a grip on the underside of it and I went for a toss. I slipped, I fell, I slammed the side of my head on the door, almost on the ground. The sides of my body were hurting. Um, my face was bruised. It was a bad situation. And that is when Karan was like, oh my goodness, we're getting you chappals and we're getting you chappals right now. It's been a shitty month. And this shopping spree that I went on, this little birthday shopping spree has been such a savior. So yeah, Karan was like slippers. And I was like, hey, if I'm getting slippers, they might as well be pink. So yeah, those are my slippers. Why am I giving you an explanation as to why I bought different things? I don't know. Let's get to the next item. Okay, so satin pillowcases. I spoke to you guys about satin pillowcases and I said, hey, I stitch my own, but I still felt like I need to recommend some pillowcases to you guys because everyone's not gonna be stitching their own pillowcases. So I ordered a bunch from Amazon to check to see the quality. This is the first pillowcase that I ordered. Now listen, I have enough pillowcases that I've stitched for myself. So this again, I'm putting into a giveaway. So that is the first pillowcase. I really like the quality. It's really nice. It's a fairly decent size, I would say. So if you have like medium pillows, then this would work for you. This is a pillowcase from the second brand. I got four pillowcases in this set. The stitching is pretty nice. And if I wasn't mistaken, I think I paid 215 rupees for four pillowcases. Uh, the size of this is a little small, so I'm definitely going to measure the exact size of this and put it in the description down below. Is this quality as great as this quality? No, but I spent 200 rupees for one pillowcase in this case. And in this, the picture on Amazon showed me that it was a set, so it said two pillowcases, but they sent me four. I don't know if that was a mistake or not, but yeah, I would say that this quality is by far better than this. This is also a tiny bit smaller. So this is what it looks like. You sort of slip your pillowcase in and it has this little sleeve. This does come with a sleeve again, but the sleeve is more towards the end. So at the side, does that make sense? But yeah, I really like the quality of this. And even if this is 200 rupees for one pillowcase, I would say this is absolutely worth it. Is it like a thousand, two thousand rupee quality? No, absolutely not. But if you're a student and you've just started CGM and you can't afford to spend like thousand, two thousand rupees on a pillowcase, I would say that these would absolutely do the job. I also bought this root comb by Roots, funnily. I bought this more to check the quality because I couldn't find any root combs on Amazon until like a few days ago. So yeah, I wanted to buy this before I recommended this to you guys. It's mediocre, it's nothing special. But yeah, I already have a root comb. I don't feel like I need another one. So this is also going in a giveaway. Let me show you the best thing that I bought. And oh my goodness, this is such a find. This is the box that it came in so this is a set of combs if i'm not mistaken i think i spent 130 rupees for it look at how many combs i got in this set are you looking at everything that is in here this is exactly like the root comb that i use and i love combs like this these are really great for getting some volume at your roots they don't mess up your hair. Look at how many combs you get in this set. Absolutely amazing. Look, are these the best quality? No, they're quite thin. They're quite patla. If you try to break it, I'm sure you can. But oh my goodness, you guys, 130 something rupees for this entire set. It is such a steal. They have white tooth combs. This is also a white tooth comb. There are tail combs. There are combs like these. This set has so much promise and oh my goodness, I love it. This is for sure one of my best Amazon finds. I mean, I wholeheartedly recommend. But do remember that the quality isn't like fantastic. You're not gonna get like sturdy, hard combs. They're pretty ladhar, but I mean, for the price, absolute winner. 
that root comb itself justifies the entire price of the entire set so yeah i'm really excited to be using this now since we're talking about combs and look, I haven't bought this right now. I bought this a while ago. I've been using this for a really long time. But since I'm talking about like an Amazon haul, right? I have to show you the unicarton of the EXO Curl Comb thing. I know I keep talking about it, but I talk about it because it is that freaking good. This comb for detangling is just a dream. You can also use this to create your curl clumps if you want if this is the size that you're looking for i absolutely love this comb and when it comes to detangling this is going to be my only recommendation to you guys it is just that good look at the unicarton it is so cute really really pretty really thoughtful now i also bought a shower cap from amazon this looked really cute it had polka dots on it the color was really sober and nice so I thought let me pick this up because it wasn't that expensive and let me show you the inside of this so you have like a double layer so it's plastic on one side and it's cloth on one side I'm sure this is washable and it wasn't that expensive compared to the other shower caps out there but yeah I thought this was really cute and really sweet so I picked this up as well I have used this on my channel. I used it with the Shirolipa mask. In case that video is out, you can check it out and you can see how I use this particular shower cap. I really like it. No complaints. Does it work as well as a flaxseed microwavable heat cap? No, but it's still calm chalao. So yeah, I received a box from Just Herbs. So these were sent to me in PR. I did not buy these on my own. Basically, they sent me their Silky Strength Shampoo because I'm out of this. They also sent me the Komoda Conditioner because I've been running very, very low on their conditioner. One more wash and I'm out of their conditioner. And lastly, they sent me this box which has The Shirolepa mask and this has to be the sweetest thing. They sent me this personalized wooden comb and it has my name on it. This is so cool. But guys, I already have the Shirolepa mask. As soon as this launched, I picked up the mask because I really wanted to show this on my channel. If you remember in my Just Herbs review, I was talking about how I've already tried their masks and I was waiting for it to launch. So yeah, this is the one that the company sent me and this is the one that I bought on my own. This is still in the unicarton wrapped up in plastic. So since I have a double of this, this will also go in a giveaway. But oh my goodness, you guys, this comb is everything. Thank you so much, Just Herbs. I absolutely love this. I'm gonna put this to great use. And yes, I know that this wasn't like a birthday present, okay, from the brand. This was more of a PR thing. Since it came close to my birthday and it has my name on it and everything, I'm just like, wow. This felt like a really nice, fun birthday surprise because I had no idea they were gonna do this with the comb and uh, I love it. It's really, really nice. It's really thoughtful. It's super personalized. Thank you so much, Just Herbs. I absolutely love your products. Okay, so since we're talking about things that I'm planning to give away, I have been buying a lot of things and collecting them in the hopes that I will have a giveaway when I hit some numbers. So I bought two activated charcoal shampoos from WOW. They had an offer going on and I bought each for 100 rupees. So obviously I grabbed them because the retail price of this is 300 rupees, but I got them for 100. So I picked up two. I also picked up two Arata hair creams because I got a buy one get one offer. So I think I paid 700 for both and that was definitely a steal so I thought let me pick up two. I also have the Biotic Night Cream. This is something that I've used for years so I picked up one as well. I'm hoping that I can keep collecting items so that I have a sizable number of things to give away. 
when the time comes and also guys whenever you leave comments and stuff if i just click on a name then i get to see the people who are really active on this channel who are really active in the comment section and i see your support i see your encouragement of course when the time comes i'm definitely going to make sure that i give back in a way that is substantial in a way that is meaningful so yeah okay products I've bought a lot of products. These are all of the products that I bought. So, I think I've already shown you the Fix My Curls Curl Quenching Hair Butter. I bought this in December. So, I also bought the Fix My Curls Protein Leave-In Cream. I think I've already shown this to you guys on my channel. So, I also bought the Curl Up Curl Defining Cream. This has protein in it. Don't let the packaging fool you. This is 150 grams or ml. Whereas this is a 200 gram container product bottle thingy. I also bought the Ashwa Leave-In. I also bought the Requil Shampoo. This is the Requil Hair Fall Shampoo. I bought the Muru Muru Damage Repair Conditioner. This is the 150 gram tube. So yeah, these are both... 150 grams each psychologically don't you feel like you get more product with the curl up because of the way the bottle is sort of shaped with the shampoo and the conditioner they sent me their oil free moisturizer and their ultra matte dry touch sunscreen gel i got this free so yeah this is a 20 gram product and this is a 30 gram product anyway this was my haul Oh my goodness, I am so flippin' excited. I am so excited to try this. Have I already sneakily tried this? Maybe, I don't know. But uh, yeah, I am so excited. I am so excited to try all of these. I've been hearing so much about Requil and all the time I get these requests that hey have you tried requill have you tried requill have you tried requill so yeah finally i'm going to be able to try them guys please be patient with me okay it is not possible for me to try everything out there it's going to take a lot of time stay with me i want to give you honest reviews and stuff so it takes a bit of time i can't just use something once and twice and recommend it to you guys it wouldn't make me feel very comfortable at the end of the day listen there's a god up above and i have to answer to him and i take my recommendations super duper seriously so yeah give me some time i'm gonna try all of these please don't send me dms asking me how is ashpa how is curl up i don't know all right uh, right now i'm gonna focus on these two products and then once i'm done focusing on these two products then I'm going to focus on these because protein moisture, protein moisture. So I'll be using this in combination and I'll be using these in combination. And then when I finally make up my mind, I'll put out a video. I think by the end of Jan, I should be able to give you a review of at least one or both of the products. Let's see. That depends on how much I wash my hair, to be very honest. When it comes to this, I still need to use it maybe twice more. Uh, yeah, let's see, maybe two, three times more for me to give you like a proper honest review because these are expensive products, right? Once I'm done with the Fix My Curls, I'll go on to this because again, moisture. By the way, moisture, okay, because um, I'm looking at the ingredients here and protein is not in the top five ingredients when it comes to the ashba leave-in cream so yeah moisture and this would be protein so i'll use this in combination so maybe by the end of feb ish i should have reviews on this but i also feel like once it's been like a year of me using all of the products i definitely want to do like an end of 2001 uh, review of different products i think that makes sense because you know, you keep changing your mind about products once you keep using them. Even if you use them for a month, right? I honestly, 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 honestly feel like if you haven't used a product for six months, then you haven't made up your mind like a hundred percent. You don't know what you feel. But that's just me. I know it's ridiculous for me to expect you guys to wait for six months for a review. But yeah, 
I think one month I'll make a preliminary like a review and then after one year I'll make like fresh reviews so that I round up all of my thoughts on the products and stuff. All right, I know this video has been super duper long, but oh my goodness. Uh, really exciting, really fun. Maybe I'll break it into two. I don't know. But yeah, I'll leave everything linked in the description so you can check that out if you want to. No pressure. This is not like a oh my god, please buy these products. No, that is not what this video is about. This video is more about this is everything that I bought and this is everything that I'm going to use so that you know what is coming on my channel because I want to take you guys on this journey with me. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If you did, leave me a thumbs up because it really helps me with engagement. Okay. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Michelle and I will see you in the next one. Bye.